Hey guys, it's Larry Greenberg, and today we're taking a look at the Shark Compact Optical Wireless Mouse. This mouse sells for only $8.99, making it a true affordable mouse for anyone that's looking to add a portable mouse to their collection or even a first wireless mouse. If you're using a laptop that has, let's say, a trackpad or a desktop that has a wired mouse and you want to switch to wireless. So this is the box that comes in. There's a few like pieces of paper or paperwork, a small instruction manual as well. And then, of course, the mouse itself. Now, on the back, you'll need to install one AA battery right here. And then in this slot is actually, as I pan around the back of my computer, uh, you'll find that there is a 2.4 gigahertz uh, USB adapter right here. I have it plugged into my computer and that is actually stored on the mouse right here so you could take it with you, which is a nice feature. That way you don't lose it. And that's what allows the mouse to communi communicate with your computer. Now I'm using this on my Mac. However, there are some features that this mouse doesn't work with uh, when you're using it with the Mac. I'll go over those in a second. But basically there are six buttons, if you will, on the mouse. The mouse itself has a really nice soft touch feel to it. Uh, so it's um, really grippy and feels comfortable to hold. The size, I think, is just about perfect as well. It's not too big, not too small. So the six buttons are, of course, your traditional left click and right click, which um, work just fine if I go up to my computer here and uh, click, you'll see that they work just fine. Uh, then there's a scroll wheel in the middle that also works fine. If I go back on my computer here, you can see I'm scrolling up and down and you get like a little bit of a clicking feel when you scroll with the mouse here. In the middle here is a CPI control. The mouse has three CPI settings, 800, 1200, and 1600. And basically there's an LED in here and you press once and the LED flashes either one, two, or three times to indicate whether it's set to 800, 1200, or 1600. So two flashes, which is what just happened now, and now three. Two flashes indicated 1200, three flashes 16, and one flash to go back to 800. The final two remaining buttons are these two uh, forward and backwards buttons. Those are the buttons that do not work on the Mac. So I'm in Chrome here trying to go forwards and backwards in a web page. And you can see what it does is actually open a new tab uh, when I double click uh, the buttons here. Um, it's doing that continuously. It will not do the forward and backward function on my Mac. I tried in both uh, Safari and in Chrome and could, could not get them to work. The only thing it would do is, like I said, open a new tab up. So if you're a PC user, I would definitely recommend it. If you're a Mac, you know, if you just want a basic mouse for nine bucks, it's a great buy. But remember, the, the front and back hair will not function as well as if you're using a PC. So that's been my brief look at the Shark cordless, uh, cordless or wireless optical mouse. This thing's super portable and sells for only nine bucks over on Amazon.com. I'll, of course, have a link to that in the video description. I'll also have a link to my full review of the mouse over on runaroundtech.com. So if you have any questions about this or anything else, Definitely drop me a line down below. Otherwise, have a great day.